Uh, so what's up guys this is your boy Nick uh, uh, from 3D Animation Guru and I'm back again and first of all I'd like to thank those guys who uh, just helped me to solve those issues and it was not an easy because I have to uh, go three to four processes and to make sure that everything worked well. So I'd like to guide those people the new beginners and also those people who have been having this issue of the Unreal Engine crashing. I had this problem when I open my meta human so let me just click here uh, when I open my meta human I could not be able to do anything to edit or to just every time I was doing it I could get a uh, uh, an, a message that GPU crashed and uh, d3 uh, d3 whatever d3 d are uh, removed so I try to uh, work out in everything I'd like to show you this one step by step on how you can fix this problem and i promise you 90 percent i will not go to the hard percent but at least 80 percent 90 percent is going to work so i'm using um um uh, an amd uh laser 5 uh, with, uh, with vegas uh 8 uh, gpu a uh, 20 gb lam so at least this is the the minimum that you need for to learn for the unreal agent 5 is 16 gb lam sometimes they say for unreal agent you can also use the 8 gb so i'll just like show this step by step so let's go so the first thing you need to do is that you need to make sure your widow is up to date so this widow up to date will help you to be able to update your softwares because most of the things that are happening at the moment they are new so if your video is not up to date you have this problem that you cannot be able to install um you cannot be able to install those the the new plugin for the um gpu so make sure that your widow is up to date and make sure you have the windows 10 or the windows 11. so check on that so after you're done now what you just need to do go to the google and we have this new uh, thing this one was released I think in April something in April some people they were complaining but this came up with a uh, a little agent 5 so it was it is not a note I think they released something like let me just check for you uh, I think somewhere here so this one that it is this was on uh, 5th uh, April so I think last at uh, like uh, this month stay this month so this is a new plugin they are calling it the adrenaline as so many people know about the adrenaline in medicine, I'm one of the medicine students. So uh, you can just know that adrenaline will just help you to boost uh, your immune system. And, you know, this one just make you that you can be able to work and stay awake for the, a long time. The adrenaline um, is also used, a, it's also a hormone. This is, uh, let me just not go deep in the medicine because right now we are there uh, trying to figure out how to make our our gpu work well and just do a great job so go to this one just light and then just check something here like they are trying to just to explain to you like i told you the unreal engine 5 and city sample so <coughs> if this one is just going to work for the unreal engine 5 it is also going to work for any other unreal engine so you can just read all those information just like the adrenaline edition 2.22.4.1 and then they just try to explain to you just check your uh, the led on graphic card which that you have to have and which they are compatible and their processor and everything they're just explaining a very good one then here they are just trying to tell you the windows 11 version 21 h2 and windows 10 um 64 byte from uh version from 1809 and later uh, so you can just check on those information so what you just need to need to do when you just come here, let me just go a uh, step back because there are some things here when you go to the drives. You just come here and choose which drive you want to update. So when you go to the AMD drives, just ch ch search for the AMD drives. Click the uh, AMD graphic card, then choose which graphic card you want to upgrade. And then here they just give you, like you see for me I have the RX Vegas series. Then just go to the LS Vegas side. Then it just give you the option whether you want the 64 or the 56. Then just click the submit. And when you click the submit, it's just going now to open for you 
this one here so it's just going to give you the option like you have the windows 11 windows 10 windows 7 but the new edition i don't think with windows 7 is just going you see there's nothing because they are just giving you the two options the first option is windows 10 and the other one is windows 11. so for the windows 10 now we still have to figure out because you have the adrenaline um 22.4.1 optional and which was the release list uh, list entry and still you have the amd uh software this is the 22.3 so i would like to adv advise you before installing any of this one what you just need to do don't uh, here also you have this on the lay down pro uh whatever so what you just need to do just go and download the auto detect auto detect and install this will help you to detect which version that you need for your computer it doesn't care whether it's the um the 2.24 or 2.3 so this will just detect the uh this one version so when you just done downloading so you can just go back to your downloads like for me i have mine here and then you have your adrenaline here just click open and say you want to install just say install and this is just going to take some minutes. so i'm not going to every step i just want to show you something here and we are doing this one in late time so for those people who just complain my video they are long they are long before because they are explaining everything step by step i don't like going shortcuts so now you have this is the our video that is going to be opened and i just want to show you something here so let's just give it like uh, some seconds here and guys uh if you have any question you can just comment below and for those people who are uh, so now you have this and this is what i was also what i was waiting for you so like you can see here the recommendation what you have for me uh this is the recommendation we have to 22.3.1 but if you just double click you have the other option here 22.4 so i can just choose 22.4 and here what i just like to do is just i just did i came here and i take that one to make sure that um uh when it's done then you can be able now to start again your computer so after that one you just need to click install and this one is just going to be installed there's something that i forgot to tell about you but i think with this auto detect it's just going to update and just going to remove the the uh the older uh, version of the uh, led on graphic so you can just first of all uninstall make sure that you uninstall everything that you have on your computer that is also easier to uninstall it it's just like just you see like for me i have all, everything here so what i just do is that i just uh, like click i go to uninstall and then i can just install any plugin that is uh linked with that one so after then now you're done you can now and everything is updated you can now just go and open your project like this one here and like you can see no crashing problem and now i have my unreal engine 5 which is just working well so if i just go to my content here just like you know the unreal engine just works like the unreal engine 4 but they have done some changes which i've just been showing you step by step and maybe we have the you see i have already downloaded the city sample crowd and then we have so i have like this one here i go to the maps and maybe click this one here and try to open and now this one is just going to work amazing so you're not going to have those issues of just like the uh, the unreal engine 5 crashing or the unreal any other unreal engine so that's how you just update and i know i did this one in most cases with the emd graphic card and for the uh nvidia just check the same update your graphic cards and make sure the windows is also up to date because there are so many things that they are changing and i think the unreal engine uh the epic games they are working with the those software to make sure that they don't have those problems so um thank you guys for watching this video and i hope to see you next on my next video and i don't have anything to say but to thank you for everything so bye bye for now